Good morning, everybody. How are we all doing? So, it's the joys of this miserable weather. You don't know whether it's going to rain, snow, hailstone, or sunshine. <laughs> so, yes, I'm just getting ready to go and take Olivia to her assessment. I'll be back soon. <laughs> Hello. Hi guys, so <laughs> I'm back. Smelly bum. I'm back. Where did she go? Do, 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 do. There you go. I'm back from an appointment and what a farce that was. So I got um a text message on Friday saying no it actually didn't even tell me to tell me the hospital I was meant to be at. And what it was for, and time, and Olivia. That's all I knew. So today when I went, I'm like, I ain't got a clue where I'm going. I got sent this way, got sent that way. Um, got sent to one ward, they sent me to a different ward. Uh, we finally got to where we need to be. And then she goes, oh, this is a telephone appointment. I said, well, it's not Pacific. or <laughs> It isn't Pacific. What it is? I didn't get nothing. If it said telephone, I won't be here. So anyway... I sat and waited, and you know what she said to me? She goes, well, I'm kind of glad you came, because they have to do that nose, not COVID, but the other one for when you're going, going into hospital, because Olivia's been in and out of hospital for so long that they need to do swab a nose, or so is it MRI? Or, I don't know, I can't remember. What's that? That's the machine I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, I got caught in the hailstone, and so my hair will not need to wash, to be honest. Um... Yeah, so I got stuck, stuck in that. So, yeah, what a farce that was. So I just come back home and I thought I'd sit and have a uh, thingy chat to you guys before I go in, make a cup of tea and crack on with a bit of housework because, you know what, today, yeah, I'm, I want... Is it bedtime yet? That's all I'm saying. Is it bedtime yet? So, so that was a pre-op assessment that we went to this morning. And so she's going for operation at the end of the month. And yeah, it's just for some dental work because Olivia, even though she's old enough to have an injection in her mouth, Olivia's scared of needles and yeah, she's scared of anything medical related anyway all it is is her mouth is overcrowded she's got too many teeth i'm like you should have given me some of them <laughs> you know what i mean try to cheer her up a little bit um, and she just needs a few fillings so what they have to do is re take a few of them out of the back so then the uh, the rest of them are is it to move around i can't remember what they said but anyway she's getting that done and then she'll have a few days off school so she's happy about that I'm a day off school. Anyway, so yeah, the weather. What's going off? I did a that on my wrist. Did a little clip earlier. It was like sunny, rainy, rail, snow. I'm like, oh my goodness, <laughs> meltdown. But anyway, guys, what did you think to my little clip yesterday? It took me. Obviously, I put up one beforehand, but I just made that up in my little editing thing. But the the one. I deleted that and then I put up the second one, which was fancy. It took me ages to make that. I did it in uh, an editing app. Uh, to, and, you know, it took me all day to figure it out. And I lost it in a file. And it took me ages to figure it out. And I managed to get it on my phone and upload it on, on my YouTube channel. So, yeah, the second one was the original. But obviously, it was stressing me out. Yeah, anyway, what did you think to it? Was it okay? <laughs> I know some people will relate to the symptoms that I have put on because fibro does not give us two hoots. What you're doing in a day, if it wants to strike, it's going to strike and it's going to get you. And I, you know, I am absolutely tired today because even though it was just a bit of on my phone, because I'm obviously staring at my phone long enough to do that. It whacked me out, so I'm still feeling it today. Sorry. Oh. 
Oh, I'll check that one off. Uh, but yeah, and obviously I took Olivia, not Olivia, Anna's boyfriend home yesterday. So a bit of driving, that just wipes me out as well. And I obviously had to get to the hospital today and it's just wiped me out. So I think I'm going to have a nap and then I'll catch up with you in a little while. Yeah, this is the kitchen which I left last night. I know I was meant to do the washing up, but yeah, she's not big and great. And I'm starting with a fibre or flare, so it's going to take me for ages, I know. Please don't judge. I'm not sure what fibre or what it is. I'll understand this. Let's do this. Oh. 20 minutes in and I've only done about five plates in a bowl. Oh, Joy's fine. Me back. I'm tired. Please. Do I need to get a cleaner? Oh, kids. Help. <laughs> oh. Dear me, been an hour and the bayek my back. I am definitely ready for bed and that's just doing the washing up. I haven't stopped in between. I know people think, oh people with fibre or chronic, oh no what's it, no actually no. You just be lazy, that's why you don't do your housework. You're lazy, you just don't want to do anything. You're lazy, you don't want to do that, this and the other. It's not the case. I'm not lazy, I'm trying to rest. You keep me energy to do these type of things. Oh, me late, you just got to wait every time, every time. Go on, uh, it's because I just had the hoover to hoover up the crumbs off the floor. The sort of sweeping brush just makes more of a mess. Anyway, me and dog air everywhere. So, I'm going to finish off. And all I need to do is wipe down the surfaces and then that's me. Yeah. Hello. <laughs>